Today, Douglas County Commissioners will vote to cut ties with the Tri-County Health Department and form their own. Number 7's Veronica Acosta joins us live. And Veronica, Tri-County's revised school mask mandate was the last straw for local leaders. It was last week Tri County's board. They approved an updated order that didn't allow counties to opt out of a mandate that required everyone two years old and older to mask up when they're inside of places like schools and daycare centers. So in response to that, Douglas County commissioners here, they had their staffers draft up a resolution that would break them away from Tri County Health Department and start their own health department instead. Now, Dugco, they have been down this road before. Last year, they threatened to break away because of stay at home orders. They ended up staying, though, after Tri-County promised some more local control, but now commissioners say they want out for good. It became pretty apparent on Monday evening in watching the Tri-County Board of Health that a real us and them situation had set up. And unfortunately, it was the people of Douglas County who were the them to the Board of Health. And I spent 23 years in business and uh, I've seen business deals go sour and. So if the resolution passes as it is expected to do, the county will have 90 days to appoint a new board of health and they'll be able to make those public health orders if they want to or if they don't want to. Of course, uh, Doug Co will keep their contract with Tri-County Health through the end of this year in Douglas County. I'm Veronica Acosta, Denver 7. All right.